Dachshunds are small but mighty. Despite being short-legged, these dogs can jump as high as 8 feet. They also love digging because they're so small and low to the ground. They can dig up the most interesting things. If you're looking for an energetic dog that loves to play and run around, a dachshund is the dog for you. Hello folks and welcome back to Smart Dog Lover. Keep watching so you discover the top 12 things only dachshund owners know about their dogs. Don't forget to hit like if you haven't already. Also subscribe and turn on notifications for more contents like this that will help you know your dog better. Let's go! Number 12. They are stubborn as hell. Dachshund dogs can be very stubborn when it comes to following rules, especially when it comes to obeying the owners of the house. The Dachshund dog breed does not like being told what to do by their owners. They won't always listen when you tell them to stop doing something or to do something else, no matter how many times you tell them. Number 11. They never forget. They learn by watching their trainer and their neighboring dachshund so they can mimic what they see. When the trainer makes a move, the dogs will imitate that movement even if it seems totally irrelevant. If the trainer moves one way and the other dog moves another way, both dogs will go back and forth between them as if playing follow the leader. Another trait that comes out of this kind of training is the Dachshunds don't forget easily. If you reward your dog with a treat every time he makes a specific move, he'll keep repeating that movement over and over again, even if you stop giving him treats after several. Number 10. They love to talk. They love to be vocal. There's nothing quite like the sound of dachshund barking at nothing in particular. If you get a dachshund for your dog, you should expect to hear this a lot of the time. They don't always listen to you. Dachshunds are stubborn, independent dogs that like doing things their own way. So if you try to tell them what to do, they're likely to ignore you. They have their own mind and will do things at their pace and on their terms. You just have to let them be. It's almost like they're saying, hi, I'm glad you're here. I love you. Let me jump on your head. They will do this even if the person has no idea who the dachshund is. Such enthusiasm is usually endearing and not at all annoying, unless it goes on for hours. Particularly since every time the dog does this, he gets a treat. Number 9. They have selective hearing. Dachshunds are also notorious for being selective with their hearing. They will usually only hear if they want something or when they think you have food for them. Anything else goes in one ear and out the other. It's like speaking to a toddler who doesn't understand anything you say but magically understands when you tell them no. Pairing dachshunds with children is a great idea because the dachshund listens just as well as the child. We know that our dachshund hears us because they are attentive to the tone of our voice and will obey commands. But they have a selective hearing when it comes to what we say. The first time this happens, it is quite shocking. It's like watching someone tune out a conversation. You're there talking, but it's as if you weren't even there. You might as well be invisible for all the good it does you. Number 8. Yes, they jump that high. What sets a dachshund apart from the other breeds is the pattern of their spinal column. The dachshund spine is slightly curved. It's so noticeable that it's even mentioned in their AKC standard. It's a physical feature that has long been used to separate these dogs from others. This is one of the major reasons they can jump that high. Their ability to go airborne for long periods of time make it possible for them to leap from great heights and still come down with enough force to make their attack effective. Number 7. They are fast. This breed is surprisingly fast. That's the first thing you need to know if you live with a dachshund. I mean, they're not like greyhounds or even border collies, but dachshunds can move. You won't catch one running around the field with a field mouse between its teeth. But if you don't pay attention for a second, that wiener dog will be halfway up your leg. 
Dachshunds are also surprisingly strong. They weigh about as much as a normal dog, but they're a lot shorter and stouter. So their muscles have less distance to travel and they have to push through less air resistance. Number six, they are good pretenders. These are expensive dogs. They have a number of different expressions that can represent happiness, sadness, fear, and other emotions. They also have a number of facial expressions that show their individuality. Of course, all dogs use their facial expressions to convey what they are feeling. But with dachshunds, it is more obvious. It's because of how they're built. When they feel good, it looks like it's written all over their faces. When they feel bad, their whole face droops down sadly. Thing is, though, you can't trust what it looks like on their face. That's because when you want them to feel happy and excited, their facial expression will look happy and excited. Number five, they eat a lot. Dachshunds or wiener dogs, as they are affectionately referred to, are very prone to overeating. Whether it be the result of food addiction or simply because they enjoy the taste of food too much, dachshunds tend to be overweight and can even become obese. This breed eats mostly meat and fish, but they also take in quite a bit of carbohydrates. Potatoes, sweet potatoes, rice, and pasta are all fair game. They also like fruits and vegetables, apples, carrots, and broccoli are popular choices, as well as cheese and cooked eggs. Many owners supplement with dry dog food or even bits of hot dogs or hamburgers to give the dogs extra protein. Number four, always the suspect. Dachshunds are terrier dogs and have a reputation for stealing objects in their owner's bedroom. This is because their long body allows them to easily enter into the room and their low position allows them to be hidden when entering. The most common objects stolen by this dog are the bedclothes of the owners. They take a special liking to the comforters since they are warm and easy to hide. When these dogs want to come out from under the covers, all they need is to move it aside with their heads and body, then come out with without any problem. Number three, they poo everywhere. Once you get a dachshund, you realize that they're pooing machines. They seem to find it very natural and normal to drop a deuce on the carpet, in the kitchen, on the stairs, especially if you're running late. They constantly leave little presents all over your house, sometimes as often as every hour. This is why most people don't let dachshunds near their bed. Trying to train a dog to hold in their poo until you take them outside is pointless. They will usually just poop when you aren't looking anyways. And trying to catch your dog in the act of pooping is impossible because they can poop so fast. So what can you do? Number two, they prefer your bed. Docks and dogs are very playful, but they are also very loyal and protective. They are the first to hop in during bedtimes. Docks and dogs can live outside, but they prefer warm spaces. So it is a good idea to have a wardrobe or a bed for them to sleep in. In fact, as much as he likes sleeping in his bed, sometimes he might sneak into your bed. If you want your dachshund to listen to you, he has got to respect you first. So make sure that he knows who is boss in the house. Number one, the love is always there. Dachshunds are very strong yet small animals, which is why many owners find them adorable. They require a lot of attention and affection from their owners, which can make them great for families with children as well as single people who want a companion. They also love to be around their owners, but also love spending time alone, which makes them great for busy families who work long hours during the week. They will still miss you though, because they enjoy being around you so much. They will cry if you leave them alone for too long. It will sound like they are in pain because they feel so lonely when you leave them alone, that they start to cry out of sadness. The love never dies. That's all folks on today's how. If you like this video, why don't you give us a thumbs up and leave a comment telling us your best experiences with dachshunds. Before we go, do make sure to like and subscribe so that you don't miss out on any dog related content from us.
Goodbye, guys.